this video from Casio Help, we're going to demonstrate how to reset all counters and totals on the SES 3000 register. So this process won't affect any of your programming, but it will reset all sales reports back to zero. So only proceed if you want that to happen. PGM key, round to off, press and hold down receipt feed, turn key to PGM and then release the receipt feed button. You then need to type in 10 number 8s and press the VAT button situated here. The machine will now perform the initialization. You'll know it's finished because you'll be returned to the main PGM settings menu and you'll get a little receipt printout with the number 8 on it slots. You can then, if you're unsure about whether your programming's been affected, well, I'll show you how to go in and double check quickly that it's all still there. And we can also run a report to prove that everything's back to zero. Okay, so the report's run. We can now go into our department settings, double check, see, Although it looks blank, I've actually got that set to TS1 and I know a program that obviously if you've got lots of programming in it will say it in all of your products. If you've not got department set up, you could check your PLUs. I've got my test PLU in there, so I'm happy that the program is all still in there. And then if you want to, you can turn the key to X or Z and run a simple report and you'll find that all the details, all the figures are back to zero. More information on using the SES 3000 and other Casio cash registers, you can click on any of the video links appearing on screen. You can subscribe to this YouTube channel or you can visit casiohelp.co.uk for more. Thanks for watching.